So today I'm talking about a Toyota with the P0161 code, what it is and how you go about fixing it. So what is a Toyota P0161 code? Well, it's an O2 sensor heater circuit malfunction bank 2 sensor 2. And what does this mean? Well, the onboard computer uses sensors located on the exhaust and they do two things. Number one, they monitor how much oxygen has been burnt off during combustion and they use this to get the air fuel ratio mixture right. And then the second thing they do is that they have heater elements inside of them so that they can monitor the catalytic converter. Since when catalytic converters start to fail they heat up so they have heater elements inside of there that monitor this so these sensors are doing two things and bank one is the side of the engine with the number one cylinder and bank two is the opposite of that so if you find the number one cylinder that'll be number one and the opposite of that is bank two and sensor two will be the second sensor going down on that side and some of the possible cause of this well it could be a bad sensor could be in the wiring like an open or a short and possibly a blown fuse and so the first thing to do when you get this code is to go find a bank two sensor two oxygen sensor and there can be some differences. They can be laid out a little bit differently depending on the year, the Toyota, the engine type, and things like this. And so it's always a good idea to go get a, a schematic for your particular Toyota. So for example, here's a 2007 Camry 3.5 liter V6. And as you can see, bank two sensor two is right here. It's after the catalytic converter. So it's always a good idea to get one of these schematics if you can, since they make things a little easier to find it. And the basics of what's going on with these sensors is that sensor one is going to be called the upstream sensor. It'll be before the catalytic converter. And sensor two is going to be called the downstream stream and it'll be after the catalytic converter. So the one non-board computer's seeing a problem with is going to be called the downstream sensor 2 oxygen sensor. And so after you locate the bank 2 sensor 2 oxygen sensor, the next thing to do is check out this wiring real good. Be sure everything's plugged in. There's no open shorts or back connections in the wiring. And basically keep in mind anything bad with the wiring can cause the same symptoms as the bad sensors. So be sure there's no issues going on there. And another thing to keep in mind is that these will be on a fuse. There'll be a fuse box inside the engine compartment and there'll be a fuse in there that these are on. So for example, here's a 2012 Toyota Camry and fuse number 33 is the air fuel sensors. So if that fuse blew, then there'd be a problem. Here's another example of a 2005 Toyota Tacoma and the AF heater is right here. This one also has a relay that if it went bad, it can cause issues. So that's also something to keep in mind. So if you check that all out, if you check out the fuses, that all looks good. There's nothing wrong with the wiring. Then very likely that sensor has gone bad and just needs to be replaced. One thing to keep in mind is that sometimes they require a special tool. Usually sensor two doesn't, since it's usually out in the open and you, so you can get on it with like an open end wrench or something like that. But sometimes they can be recessed into the exhaust. So it's always a good idea to go and look and be sure because sometimes they do require the special tool but like I said usually sensor 2 doesn't require the tool but it's a good idea to go look and make sure since sometimes you do require the special tool to get it back in and go around that wire I'll put a link down below to show you what I'm talking about if you need to see what it is and so that's basically it I just want to give a real quick brief overview of how you go about fixing a Toyota with the P0161 code if you have anything to add please comment down below if you have any questions ask me and I'll try to answer them if this video helps you please click like please click subscribe and have a good day